What's good? We back with the Boston Clinic and more. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy CJ Goodfellow. Y'all know how we do it. Um, like I said, big announcement coming. So check out the uh, Al Hammond vs. Jay Z B video dropping immediately after the NCAA College Football National Championship. Um, in the video in real quick. Shout out to my boy Julius Henderson. Um, you know, new K O T R <laughs> boxing group. Hopefully, I got the right. Um, you know, but don't forget, we got the tech channel. I'm to drop a video on there. Um, difference between Android boxes and uh, Fire TV sticks and Fire TVs and how to jailbreak and get free cable and all that stuff. So that link will be in the description. The Facebook group will be in the description. If you want to donate, got some big, big news coming. Um, you know, so, but uh, Adrian Broner uh, confirmed that he's been in talks to face Amir Khan or Omar Figueroa on Instagram while training with Kevin Cunningham down down in West Palm Beach, Florida. Um, you know, Kevin, this is on Instagram. I'm going to leave a link to the Instagram page as well or directly to this. And this is Adrian Broner, verified page. I ain't got a date yet, but I ain't about to rush into no more fights. Unprepared-ish just don't work that way. That's how I lost in the Porter fight and the Mikey fight. I rushed my camps and my man, and I'm, I guess, and I'm man enough to own up to my f ups, but I ain't talking ish for granted. Or I ain't taking ish for granted. Excuse me, no more. I will be a hundred percent for this next fight, no matter if it's against Omar Figueroa Jr. or me, Amir King Khan, or anybody else who want to fight me. Showtime Boxing. I'm sorry, Espinosa, which is the head of Showtime Sports. I know you and Al had real good plans for me, but I promise you, them plans are still available, and I will show up. I will show that. This next fight, so let's get this money and run the numbers up. Return of the can, man. Hey, B. Well, he need to check his English, man. Maybe it just ran. I told you guys earlier in the uh, American Adrian Broner rumor uh, fight. Shout out to Ashley's Corner for putting me up on Game of Seven Day Sports. That Amir, that uh, you know, Adrian Broner was down there training in West Palm Beach, Florida, with Kevin Huntingham and, and Devin Alexander. Uh, he had beat Alexander in the race. It looked like. They is, uh, you know, Alexander shining for Victor Ortiz on regular Fox. So that's huge for him. Um, you know, February 17th, then later that night to be um, Ronald Greville versus Danny. I mean, versus David Benavidez <clears throat> and Mikey Garcia versus Sergey Lipinis on Showtime. So, um, you know, it's not like he's still making excuses. Um, said he rushed his camp for Sean Porter and uh, Mikey Garcia. Um, you know, it is what it is. Like my boy Correa said, ILTBA Boxing Talk. They don't train right with uh down there in Ohio with Mike Stafford and Broner Easter Jr. It's something that they lacking and they missing. But um, if he rushed his fights, that's on him. Take your time, be patient. You know, cause in boxing, that one loss is real, real critical, and uh can change a lot. You know, and it seems like he's still making excuses. You know, after the Mikey loss, he said, "Y'all mother F is still gonna come see me." No matter if I lost, and like my boy said, the cry comes before the fall. But um, he got to show me, you know. Um, I think Omar Figueroa and Amir Khan crushes him if he don't get his stuff together. But he never will get his stuff together, you know. If he couldn't get his stuff together after the Madonna loss, you know, to Mikey, to Sean, I mean, you know, no, I mean nobody's taking him serious no more. He wanted to get the respect back on his name, like Birdman say, of the fans. And, um, you know, take it serious then, man. There's so many flaws in his game. People say, oh, he's this good. I just see flaws and flaws. And one of them is, you know, hard work. He got talent, but he don't work hard. And uh, he got to work hard, work smart, and make people believe in him again. I ain't going to believe in him until he do something significant. He was running day talking about five-time champion. I don't see that happening. But uh, it seems like they want to put Broner in with Omar or Amir Khan. And use him as a stepping stone. He think the can man can come back. But I think. No. Nah, I think it's over for Broner. You know. He knows it. We know it. Um, no matter how serious he takes it. It's too late. Let me know what y'all think. We gone.